Hey, it's LSFT here today again. Uh, today we opened up my Lexus app and I saw that there was a recall. So the recall is related to the vehicle's uh, stability control. Uh, what it's saying is that uh, there's a software issue where the vehicle will not have it on by default when you start your vehicle. Um, and there's most likely a software update that has to happen. This seems to be happening to uh, all vehicles that is in Canada and the United States and I've even seen it in Asia. I've also went to the uh, Lexus website to actually see if there's more information. So I put in my VIN and I actually crossed it out on the screen and it did show that there was a, a recall and it's the same description and there is actually an uh, additional information that I can actually pull out. So if you need to pause this video, go ahead and you can read it uh, a little bit more. But in short, it does look like that um, there is a software error and it can cause the vehicle stability control system not to default on on the next time you start your car. So under some certain circumstances, it does, does not happen. And uh, because I'm in Canada, it does say that the regulations in Canada does not allow that. So that's why there is this um, recall. So Lexus does look like he, they are looking at it um, and that they will be developing a fix to this. And we will be getting a notification by a letter, first, first class mail, and then scheduling to your local Lexus dealership uh, a service call so that you can actually get it um, fixed. On a side note, I did see that um, on the forums, uh, there's other recall notices provided to other uh, Lexus owners, Lexus NX owners, and it does look like it's um, Lexus um, owners who actually received their vehicle earlier, and this one seems to be a lot more uh, of a issue. They're saying that potentially that there's missing spot welds on certain models of the NX250, 350, 350H, and the 450H plus vehicles. It's saying that the front shock absorbers in the affected vehicles are mounted to the body panel and that there may be some missing spot welds. So incorrect welding could eventually cause a shock absorber to separate from the mounting area, resulting in loss of driving stability and increase of risk of a crash. So this one seems to be a lot more serious and I'm hoping that um, Lexus will actually get this repaired as soon as possible. I also saw an update that uh, vehicles are actually stopped at port. They're actually holding the new vehicles at port because of this recall of this uh, the vehicle stability controls. Uh, I guess that they're waiting for the software update so that they can actually release this because I believe this violates um, the US and Canadian laws and that it must be turned on uh, when you start your vehicle. So hopefully this gets resolved quickly and uh, potential new owners will be getting their vehicles quickly. So there we have it. Two recalls today on the new 2022 Lexus NX. I'll keep everybody posted on my NX and see when it'll get repaired. So make sure you subscribe, like, and comment uh, on this video. And make sure you click on that alert bell so that you will get up-to-date videos when I get them posted. Thanks for watching. Cheers.